Nebori. Hey, welcome back to our Super Direct TV. It's up, Corbin. I'm Alex. Micah. Ashley. Rick. And you call us honey. It's the ground and quick job. It's so juicy. For more spicy noodle content. Yeah. yeah. And it'll be driven from the uh, video title, you see what we are doing. Uh, this got recommended to me on Twitter. Uh, somebody said, Corbin, you should try these. And I said, what, ramen noodles? <laughs> Apparently not. Uh, these are called Maggie uh, Two Minute Noodles, Authentic Indian Noodles. Masala spicy. Oh, they're spicy? Ugh. So, uh, apparently these are like a staple. Yeah, like, this is the noodle that Indrani eats, like, regularly while I'm talking I about went it. to the store, it was the first shelf, and it was all full, and uh, yep. there were like three people on the line in front of me, and all of them... Yeah, I guess this is the ramen noodle of India. Yeah. Because in America, ramen noodles are the... Well, the, I asked them, uh, I said, are these ramen noodles? They said, well, it, they are ramen noodles if ramen noodles weren't bland. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shots okay. fired! Uh, so, wow. but and then here's a little uh, synopsis of them. Oh, oh my! I'm ready. Maggie is liquid gold. Maggie well. is curry flavored magic. My childhood in a bowl. Maggie is perfect when soupy, perfect sans broth. Sans broth, perfect even straight out of the fridge. Uh, what Maggie is is this: a brick of instant noodles that you crack in half over boiling water, then cook with the flavored powder that looks like straight up turmeric and tastes like 200% of your dadium sodium intake. <laughs> <laughs> so similar to ramen. Right, yeah. right? But I think this is gonna pack some heat. Pack some heat and with the Indian flair and flavor. Too. Yes. So uh, we're, I'm gonna do a little quick cooking of it. Looks like it should just take two minutes. This is gonna make you wanna do a Bollywood dance number. Over the toilet, maybe. <laughs> you're a child and can't handle anything. <laughs> yeah, we, I think we all agree. Uh, it smells like what ramen we know noodles. as ramen noodles, which I'm sure you know as well. With uh, just a little bit of curry. Yeah, and so it smells like it has a little bit of uh, Indian masala, right? A little something, right? something. Mm. A little something, something. So uh, let's just uh, dig in here. It's gonna be hot. It's Ooh. really hot. I'm digging in two Ooh. ways. The first way is in honor of Indrani, because she eats hers with two forks. It was spicy. Mm. Does it? Mm. Yeah, but it's not bad. You know, my ramen noodles I don't like with uh, the soup. I like yeah, it. I just like the noodles. Yeah, I, I don't I don't like to have the soup. It's just it's like, like honestly. Ramen noodles with like a little something spicy in there. Spicy ramen noodles. Yep, and now the Italian way. It's pretty good. Yep. Not a lot of spice in there. Personally, I feel like it tastes like ramen noodles. I don't think it's more I feel like it tastes better if you made it the way you did. Yeah, how do you, how do you normally make your you do the noodles and the water, and then you set that, you put that in a bowl, and then you put the spice on it. Yeah, I, yeah. I feel like that's what a lot of people do, because that makes the flavor stronger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so maybe, Great. yeah, I drain the water out, we were except for a very little bit, Yeah. and then put the seasoning in, so it's strong. Yeah, we were told to put the seasoning in the water uh, mm -hmm. from the packet. Right. And so that's what we did. Which I think is what ramen noodles does. Yeah. We also put soy sauce in our ramen. Yeah, I mean, that's what ramen says to do. Yeah, our, our ramen, ramen says put it in the water. Yeah, but we make it where you pour we most of the water out. Way. Yeah, but I, this is definitely basically from what we know as Indian ramen noodles. That's what you would call these, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Basically, it's I like call it spicy ramen noodles. Yeah, it's the exact same type of noodle with it's a little bit of spice. Yeah. I don't think it tastes it's any different. Barely any spice. I don't even taste very much spice no. in there. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I would I eat this. Like, I want to try it the way we eat. 
to see what to see what Sadly, the actual we flavor. don't have any it's good <laughs> um, but you can let us know how you eat it how do you make it it's tasty are you talking oh i thought you were talking to rick no <laughs> how do you make it we're still talking to the babies yeah but people make ramen different like everywhere yeah yeah, I'm, and my bet is that Indians are like, yeah, we do this, but then we also add like tons and tons of spices on yeah. top of it, like to make it like fancy ramen. Do you have the ramen? There? Well, that's what we do. One of the best ramens I've ever had, this will come as no surprise, was in the airport in Shanghai. Oh, then yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It was like, oh, next level. The yeah. best ramen I've ever had was New York, New York City. Like, oh, oh, that was, my gosh. That, was that was awesome. That was the best ramen. Yeah. Oh. Well, that, I think we can all agree it's tasty. Very tasty. It's very tasty. Very hot. Uh, let us know what else, uh, if there's stuff that we have here before we come to India that we yeah. can try. I'm going to name mine. What? AR. AR. <laughs> AR Ramen. Mm. Badaching. Thank you very much. 